The election of 1800 was a hard-fought battle between Thomas Jefferson, John Adams, and Aaron Burr. Adams was quickly cast out of the race, mainly due to the animosity towards him felt by both the Democratic Republicans and a splinter sect of the Federalists led by Alexander Hamilton. Additionally, the other Federalist candidate, Charles C. Pinckney, was short on political experience. Despite being favored by Hamilton, Pinckney soon dropped out, leaving only Jefferson and Burr. The House of Representatives was nearly completely balanced at the time of this election. Additionally, Virginia changed its system so that the candidate who won the state received all the votes. Finally, the plan was for Burr to come in second as Jefferson's vice president. However, Burr decided that he would rather be president himself and began campaigning against Jefferson. Vote for Jefferson! The government you will like is the government you deserve. I say that law is whatever is only asserted. All those in favor of Aaron Burr, of Jefferson. After the Electoral College voted in a 70 to 73 tie, Alexander Hamilton began frantic attempts to switch the vote in Jefferson's favor. After several efforts from Hamilton, Congress voted 10 to 4 in favor of Jefferson. Hamilton's intervention enraged Burr, triggering a series of letters between the two. After much back and forth, Burr issued a challenge to Hamilton, sparking a gun duel between the two. The duel was to be carried out in Weehawken, New Jersey. Both men arrived, but only one was going to leave. <laughs>